Hi, this is Satya from SLX and we're here on the last day of the World Economic Forum's annual meeting 2019. Davos yesterday had a session of the Open Forum with Kailash Satyarthi, the Nobel Peace Prize uh, winner. I was told that in fact uh, the session is going to ha air a documentary uh, which was The Price of Free. I was not sure I wanted to sit through a 90-minute documentary, so I sort of sat myself at the edge, uh, you know, giving myself the option to be able to leave for a bit and come back or something like that. Um, and then uh, the documentary began, and I could not take my eyes off the screen for a moment. It was the most riveting and most compelling experience I ever had. Those who think that slavery has been abolished, they are wrong. Abhi sab log koi dar raha hai? Tum log dar rahe ho? Daro nahi. Ye kya banda hai, beta? My colleagues and I have freed over 80,000 children, but that is not enough. Chup, chup. Hey, what are you doing? Rescue operations and raids are important, but one tiny part of the whole movement. I have one single mission of my life, that every child should be free to be a child. I have seen that change is possible. If you see any kind of abuse and exploitation of any child anywhere, break the silence. March with me. So it was not just a story that stood there, it actually spoke to each one of us in the audience. And with me were a lot of students and a, young, and a lot of young people who I could see were so moved and touched by the whole experience. So when Kailash Satyarthi came onto the stage, uh, it was, it was uh, a truly awe-inspiring moment as he shared his personal motivations uh, with everybody and he inspired everyone to, to be a change maker, to actually embrace uh, the leader within. Those who believe that 100 million young drivers should shape a new world, a better world to save this generation and all the generations to come, then raise your hands. I would like to thank you for sharing the love the power, your ambition, and everything. I think those are the most important. It's so, so great what you did. What, where did you have this power from, this ambition, everything? How did you survive all these bad things you've seen? Yeah, and I just wanted to thank you for all that. Thank, thank you, you, thank you, thank you. <laughs> Frankly speaking, and uh, I draw the power from you, from young people. When you raise your hands, I felt empowered. It was a, uh, an incredible moment and then he walked down towards us at the end of it uh, and you could see the humility, you could see how, uh, how he was, uh, you know, such a genuine and caring and loving person uh, and everyone there wanted to hug him. I think everybody in the audience just wanted to go up to him and just give him a big hug. It was such an emotional moment, I would even say it was almost a spiritual moment. I've been to many, many Davoses so far and I can tell you that that was a moment, that was an unforgettable moment. And this is the sort of transformation we need uh, to see in our societies. And that he was able to evoke this and create this kind of thing leaves me with a lot of hope. And we hope that you know each one of you who's listening is able to, to imbibe this uh, spirit and energy. I hope you enjoy listening to us sharing this experience with you and that you too would feel inspired uh, please remember to follow and subscribe and we hope that we'll share many such exciting stories with you in the days to come. Thank you.